Spare my life, please. 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 Hey! Please! Please! Please spare my life! Please! Please! Hey! 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 Oh, mama! of our ancestors. The ears of the elephant was made to listen to all kinds of stories. Speak! Oh, I see that hear it. How to do bella or cribella, patak 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 How to do bella or cribella, patak 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 What I did to Aboma, your son's betrothed wife, is just a warning. And that will be the last warning. Get your son to go and report what they did to me to the elders. Or be prepared to bury him when next I come. Like I said, last warning. That serves you right, you rapist. What did you just say, Father? I said it serves you right. What were you expecting when you raped and murdered the son? Oh, you thought our spirit would just cry to the land of the dead and do nothing to you. You were wrong. You were wrong, son. You were wrong. What? How? How did you know? Our spirit appeared at the scene where our woman died. Our spirit just two left here before you arrived. And she said the next time she would be here, it will be your turn. Except you report what you did to her. The elders. What? Yes. How could I possibly do that? Father, this is like asking me to go and commit suicide. Is your wretched life more important than ours? Is your wretched life more precious than ours? If you are counting on me for protection this time around, count me off. I told you the last time that the gods want me against that if I ever love my life. Listen to me. If you were counting on me to disobey the gods to save you again because you are my only son, you lied. Listen to me very well. I swear it to you before Uruala and all the gods of our land that I will never get involved again. May the gods of our land kill me if I ever do it again. You're working out on me, Father. Oh, okay, good. If you walk out on me, I will do exactly what Uzuma has caused to want. But I will report every rape case, every rape case I've been involved in this village, and I will tell them how you've been covering it up because I'm your only son. Oh, 
Sokak is better than this stuff in the bag. Isaac, I told you. I told you it was wrong. It was wrong to do. To, to, to do what? He told you what? You want to put the blame on me now? No, you want to put the blame on me. How many times did I beg you? How many times did I beg you? Let us leave Ozoma alone and go for ordinary woman to have fun with. Did I not tell you? Because you watched her through the window having sex with your uncle. You said to yourself, you must have a taste of her body and it will not pass today. Was that not what you told me? Was it not what you told me? No. Oh, sh 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 shut up! Shut up! Now, when you failed to handle her as a man and allowed her to blow your cover, let me ask you, how would we have covered our tracks if we did not kill her? How? Azuka! Iruka! Azuka! Iruka! Azuka! Iruka! I don't want to die. I don't want to die too. I don't want to die. I don't want to die too. If I come with you, I call. What I want, you need to put Jinuchi guy, Jinuchi guy. I talk. What I'm supposed to be listening now, and what you're supposed to be telling me now is how to, what to do to leave. Yes, the only thing you have to do now is to shut up. Let us wait for my mother's arrival because she went to consult the deputy. That is what I'm doing now. Yes, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. Mother, mother, mother. How, 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 how was it? Anywho. The moment this necklace leaves your neck, you will be at the mercy of Ozoma's angry ghost. So said Titibia. For me to get these two necklaces, I was condemned to eating my own stool each time I go to the toilet. No thanks to both of you. Thank you. Thank you very much for doing this to me. Thank you. I wish tomorrow were today. Why would you say that? I said so because I cannot wait to come to your end and meet your parents to pay your bride price. Do you know, I love you so much. I love you so much that each day that passes by and I did not spend it with you, I feel so empty. <laughs> well, I love you too. And I know you love me so much. But you have to be more patient. A little more patience. Very soon, we'll spend the rest of our life together. Thanks for seeing me off. Uh, 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 you see, accompanying you to wherever you go is a duty I love to perform. Hey, let's have the tightest hug ever for this line. <laughs> Please, take care of yourself. Bye-bye. <laughs> ah, my love! There's something I took from you when you were sleeping in your house. And what would that be? No, 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 please. You, you, you can't take it. Please, yeah. give, give it to me. I just said I took it because I like it. Yes, but this, this, this particular... Let me tell you. You can take anything you want from me. You can ask for anything and have it. But this one, you cannot have it. You didn't it. just say that, did you? I, 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 I am sorry, Oh, but please spare me that useless sorry. As far as I'm concerned, I don't care about how sorry you are. Take it. But if you live with this necklace, forget that you ever met someone like me. Because I can't spend the rest of my life with a man who attaches more importance to a man necklace than the feelings I have for him. Are you ready to take it? I take that for you. Oh! 
Please, 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 Uzuma's spirit is angry indeed. Why didn't you come straight after parting with Isia? Uh, wise one, it, it's only my mother that knew this place before now. I, I, I ran to her to tell her what happened. In fact, I, I had gone in dog on her instruction to get money to proceed to your place before I saw the ghost. Please help me. You took the right decision to come to me immediately after the seizure. Uzuma is planning to distress you publicly and finally kill you. If you ever step into Isako's compound tomorrow, your next seizure will happen. Just as she's about to hand the acceptance wine over to you. Uh, may the gods forbid. In Idigo, epilepsy is regarded as a special kind of punishment from the gods for any hidden sacrilege committed by the victim. And first thing my people will do is to chase the victim out of Idigo and then consult the oracle to find out what he did. Uh, uh, wise one, if that happens, I will not just only lose Isiak, but I will be doomed forever. My son, Mother. Don't, don't talk like that. Don't talk like that. You are my only son, for goodness sake. Uh, mother, mm -hmm. I swear, if I ever have seizure in public, I will take my own life. No. Uh, uh, mother, we are talking about disgrace, a total disgrace of not just only me, but for the entire family. Mother, what is life without honor? Our people are going to kill me if they find out. Don't. Don't, don't you, don't, don't, don't you understand? Don't, don't you understand? Azoka, nothing will happen to you. You will not die. You will live and marry Siako and give me grandchildren. I know of that. Mother, which maiden in this part of the world in her right senses will agree to marry an epileptic? I have committed a grave sin and that is it. Please allow me to do what Ozuma's ghost wanted. I am sure she's going to rest upon my death. My son, you will not die. That is why we have come to consult to me. He was the one who gave me that necklace that protected you before. And I'm sure he will do it again. Just calm down. Oh? Why is one? There has to be a way out. There must be a cure for, for this epilepsy. You can pacify Uzuma's spirit or even cage, cage it. That is why we have come. Hey! Afanago! What shall I do? Getting the necklace back is out of the question. It lost its potency the moment she removed it. Is 
is only the chief priest of Umuele on whose soil Ozuma was violated and murdered can save the situation by caging her angry spirit. No other person in the whole world can, not even me. Brother, did you hear that? How could the chief priest of Umuele help me when he had vowed never to help his only son before the oracle? How? Why is what? Father, I'm not lying to you. It happened today. And as I'm speaking to you here, his people would be going to Awaka's compound to pay Isiaku's bad price tomorrow without him. This is because Uzuma planned to strike Azuka with another epileptic seizure during the ceremony. If she, should he go there? Father, according to the Dibia they consulted, you are just the only one, the only one who can cage the angry spirit of Uzuma. Failure quits if she returns in 16 days. She will kill the both of us. And you heard me vow before the gods the last time never to get involved again, didn't you? Such vows can only be broken with the blood of a virgin. And that is a sacrifice I am not ready to offer for the sake of rapists and murderers like you. Go and tell that to your useless friend. Hey, Papa, I'm your only son, oh. You don't have another one, I'm your only son, oh. Hey, okay. Since the day I saw you murder that innocent woman, my own late brother's wife, I started regarding myself as a man without a son. You may not know this, but let me tell you the truth. You are already dead in your wickedness. Oh yes, look at you. Instead of feeling remorse for what you did, you went ahead to spread wicked lies that Uzuma ran away with a stranger to a distant land in order to avoid taking care of her little children. By the way, how many times have you and that your wicked friend gone to see those three little orphans? None. You know what? You are too wicked to deserve my sympathy or that of anyone. Now get out of my sight before I strike you dead myself. Get out! My father wants Uzuma's spirit to kill the both of us. I don't, the problem is, I don't know why he... he... Hey! Azuka! 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 Hey! Azuka! 
Siako, how could you say such a thing? Iberichi, you don't understand. Did you hear them at all? I did. They said that earlier today, Asuka climbed the pear tree to pluck pears and got stung by angry whaps he accidentally the stop. Then he fell from the tree and sustained injuries. That made it impossible not to be here to commence your bridal rights. Iberichi, tell me. What's, what's so bad that you're here vowing to me that you will never marry him again? Listen, everything about it is bad. It's a very bad sign. In fact, it's a bad omen. If the bride or the groom is involved in any sort of accident on a day like this, according to our traditions and custom, listen, my sister, for this, I will never marry Azuka again. This marriage will not hold. It's your hey. Here you are, my pretty angel. You see, Akunaya? My daughter, everything is set. Your father sent me to bring you, to perform the acceptance uh, wine rite. Eh? Mother, who am I going to hand the wine over to? Is my husband to be there? Is he there? Of course, my dear. His people explained why he is not here. And uh, Ojindu, his uncle, is here to represent him. Our custom allows that. And that won't work for me. Not in my marriage, mother. Tell them that I won't be part of anything they are doing here today if Azoka is not present. Pa! Are you out of your mind? Oh, you want to disgrace this family, eh? Come on, will you follow me? It's all right. If you force me to come with you, I will. But I will still throw the wine on the floor when father gives it to me. What? And you know what that means? In our culture and tradition that marks the end of this marriage. Ibirichi, mother, please. I've been talking to her for almost half an hour now, but she wouldn't listen. Ibirichi, I'm. Is she angry? Ibirichi. Nai, I want to talk to you privately, please. Privately? It's urgent. Nai, she refused to come. She even threatened to pour away the wine. Please, uh, I'll join you soon. Do so, by the way. Isiako, Isiako, please. Isiako, please just listen to them. Hmm? Oh, God, to the land. Isiako. Everybody, get up, get up, get up. I said, get up. He said, look at me. Is it true what your mother just told me? Yes, father. Even the threat to throw away the wine if you are forced. I, I, father, I will never marry Azoka unless. It's okay. I will not force you. Nay. Yes. The evil man does not force his daughter into marriage. Not just as a matter of principle, but because. It is forbidden in our customs and tradition. Father, are you serious? Oh, yes. But before I leave here now, let me give you a vital piece of information. Three days ago, as you girls were returning with your mother from the, from the farm, you saw a young man with two elderly men leaving our house. Yes. Didn't you? Yes, I did. The young man came here to seek for a marriage's hand in marriage. And your sister has accepted. Oh, yes. In three days' time, they will be here to perform the marriage rites. Hi, uh, um, uh, is that true? Yes. yes. Now, in the customs and tradition of Humuele well, community, if there are two or more medians in a family, all must marry in their order of seniority. And if for any reason the 
younger one happens to marry before the older ones, the older one automatically becomes a taboo in her father's house and must take up temporary residency in her grandparents' home until she gets married herself. Your mother was an only child, as you already know. And your maternal grandparents were long dead. Their house became so dilapidated that their neighbors had to demolish it seven years ago. Also, the disagreement your mother had with your uncles over the disposal of your grandparents' properties. They don't even care if you are alive. Now, if you stick to your gun here, I will just go and tell Asoka's people to forget about the marriage plan. But before doing that, let me inform you that if your sister gets married before you, you will become a vagabond. Is that what you want, Isiako? Is that? Okay. <coughs> um, um, uh, please. There is no cause for alarm. Yes. Part of the things my daughter wants to wear to appear before you was locked up in a box inside the house. Okay. So I went in to give them the keys. So very soon they will tell you. That's the guy who went. Oh, 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 Father, I call you here to inform you that the Beretti's husband and his people will be coming here in four days' time to conclude her marriage. Why? Father, why the urgency? Her bride price was just paid three days ago. I've accepted to marry Azoka. Why not mine first? My dear, in a matter like this, the groom has to find herself. Myself, as father of the bride, I cannot say anything. Mother. Wise one, the last time we came here, you said we should give you good of five days. This is the sixth day, and nothing we've said nor done could make him change his mind. Not even the suicide threat from his son could make him change his mind. Please help us. Wise one, these few days had I've been a trying one for me. Thirteen seizure in all. Only the gods know. Why my fiance has not caught me in any? I, 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 these days I spend almost all my days indoors. Please, I beg you, help me. I don't want to be disgraced publicly by this epilepsy and my marriage to Isiak ruined as a result. I love her so much. I don't want to die. There is nothing you can do. Nothing you can do to change Ibudu's mind. I just returned from a meeting I have with him in the spiritual realm before you arrive. Oh my please, he fell on deaf ears. He has made up his mind to accept the worst rather than help out in the case. How? Oh, 
because of my ancestors. Help me. Help me and I swear never to rape again. I will never rape again. Wise one, please help me in this situation. I promise and I swear here that I will help. In fact, I will take care of uh, Zuma's children until they grow into adulthood. Please, I beg you, just give me a way out. I pray you. Yes, wise one. There must be a way out. Please help us. Help me. I don't want to lose my only son. Please. The only way out is to kill him so that another can take over his post and cage Uzoma's spirit for you. Wise one. Kill a priest to a powerful deity like Ibudu. What kind of a human being can possibly do this? Only the one that will succeed him can do it. And who is that? Achike. Oh yeah? Achike? No, Achike cannot do a thing like that. Achike that I know cannot take away a strand of hair from his father's body, let alone killing his father. Achike cannot do a thing like that. Um, but then find a way to force him. Else, my hands are off your case from this moment. Wise one, please. Please help us. I am true with you. Out. Out! You must be out of your mind, Azoka. How could you? How could you tell me to kill my own father? Ask me to kill my own father for you? It is you and I, Achike, that our lives have been threatened by an angry ghost. Yes, an angry ghost! Huh? Azoka, you are not serious. Yes, you are not serious. In fact, if it is why you called me to this place, I am out of this place. Azuka! 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 Give me, bring my necklace or Azuka! 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 Message me, bring my Azuka! What is your mission? Wise one, 
Mais um. É mais rude. Mais mais rude. Mais mais rude. Mais mais rude. Mais rude. Uzuma took your manhood. And you are here. Am I Uzuma? Mais um, please help me. Help me. My father even refused to listen to me when I ran to him for help. Hmm? Please, Nai. Hmm? I, can, I can't face this disgrace. I can't. It, it, it's, it's, a, it's a big disgrace, Nai. Now you're not told that only you can save the situation yourself. If your father refuses, do the necessary to recover your manhood. My hands are washed off your case already. And for your information, you have. Ten days remaining. Ten days before Uzuma returns to kill you and Azuka. Kill your father, else you die. Leave now. Leave! Mother, I don't understand the kind of life one is living. You cannot have peace of mind, even for one hour and kitty. You can't. But you caused it yourself. Somebody will attract a problem and some other person will solve the problem. Why is this one different? Eh? Azum! Ah! Isiak! Isiak, my love! <laughs> eh. Okay! What is it? Oh! Greetings, mother. Miss Yaku, how are you? I'm fine, mother. I'm here to see my husband. Um, uh, come with me to the kitchen. Um, mother, that should be when I'm done. I need to see him and discuss something very important with him. Well, I'm sorry you can't see him. Why? I just heard him call me. I know. I'll, I will explain everything to you later. Mother, are you seeing clearly? Do you still know the person you're talking to? The person standing before you is Azoka's wife. And I said I need to see him now. Isiako, I am neither blind nor deaf. I know you. But I have told you that you cannot see him now. Period. Azum! Oh, mother. Azum! Azuma, I need to see you now. Mother is blocking my way. I beg in the name of the gods. I need to see you now and discuss something very important with you. And mother is blocking my way. Isiako, are you disobeying me or something? Not at all, mother, but I need to see you. Is it true that your younger sister's wedding is coming up this weekend? Correct me if I'm wrong. You have come to appeal to my son, Azoka. So that he can fix your wedding on or before that time to avoid you being forced out of your father's house. Well, I take your silence to mean that I'm right. If that is why you're here, just get out of my compound or I will delay your own wedding till next year. Mother, did you just say that? I did. You heard me correctly. You heard me very well, Isiako. Live in peace, or you will be forced to live with your wicked maternal uncles for another year. How do you choose? Isso é 
Saco! She has been in this house. Where is she coming back from? That I never knew when she left for the place. Nanya, I don't know. I learned from a Bereshi that uh, uh, she's not in the house. And she refused to tell her where she was going to. And she came back, locked herself inside? Isiaku, open this door now! No! No, father, go away. Isiaku, you're talking to your father. Where are your manners? Gone to the coast land of Miss Bodger's mother. My manners and my honor as a woman have been stolen by this girl's mother. Yes, I am nothing but a walking dead. A walking bad dog. Don't go away. Isiako, I am going for my embezzle. And if I come back and stay me this door, Lord, it's only to work here, Mama, that, 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 that will save, 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 save the day. Isiako. Isaac, please open the door. No! Isaac, Isaac. No! 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 No, just let me be. Let me be. Allow me to wallow in pain. Let me be. I will not open the door. I will not open the door. Please take it easy. Nine, take it easy so that you won't injure her. She have done to. No, no, I don't know. Hey, it's Yaku! It's Yaku! yourself <coughs> you cost beast find it or you will die disgracefully I know I know so where is it use the same weapon you've used to kill your father to force the answer to that question out of my mouth you cost beast <coughs> go ahead you cost this.
Ajanya mutal Allah Dibanyai bebek juga Dibanyai bebek juga Dibanyai bebek juga Dibanyai bebek juga Now, talk now. Azuka, we are finished. How? Um, did your father escape? No, Azuka. I killed him as we planned. <laughs> yes. But there's a problem. problem. What is the problem? Azuka. You, you, you said that is the problem. What is the problem? Azuka. Without the Akadiki. His official symbol of authority. I cannot take over from him as the chief priest of Ruruala. And nobody else can. And he refused to tell me where it was before he died. Hey! Azuka. I've searched everywhere. Searched every corner. I cannot find it. Hey! Well, why did you kill him before? Hey! 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 hey. That means I'm going to die. That means Uzuma's ghost is going to kill me by the time it returns. Hey! Okay. Calm down. Oh, okay. I should calm down. Azuka, calm down. I should calm. Let's let's. It's, it's, it's okay. It's okay. I I I'm calm. I'm calm now. Eh? At least I know that I I I am going to die by the time Uzuma's ghost returns. I will die calmly. But I am going to die. But that will be. Oh, oh, wait, I don't want Azuka, come to me. Do you think I'm enjoying this? Azuka! Azuka! Put yourself together! Stop this, Azuka! Stop it! Stop it! Do you think I'm enjoying this, Azuka? I just murdered my own father in cold blood just to save the both of us! Yourself together. Let us go back to me and find out where the Akadiki is before it becomes too late. Stop this! That's why I give me the knife. Give me! Give me, give, 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 give me the knife! Let's go. Azuka! Let's go. 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 let us Wise one. Wise one. Neither me nor any other Dibia can help you, no matter how powerful. Unless you first find and possess the Akadike, whoever that tries to help you shall be instantly struck to death by the gods. The warning has already gone round the spirit world. Uh, 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 
how can that be a wise one? Mm. O o Ozoma spirit is... Ozoma spirit! Will never spare the both of you. Unless Achike find the Akadike and get installed as the next chief prince of Oruwala. And in that capacity, he is her angry spirit himself. Uh, uh, wise one, that is why we're here. Where can I find it? I mean, the Akadiki. Please, please, spare us, please, please. No, please, please spare us, please. Young man, Uruala and the spirit of our mother priest are indeed angry. And for my own safety, I will speak no more on this issue. And no Dibia will do for the same reason. And should any of you approach any Dibia or any deity for the same issue, both of you will be struck dead by Uruala that moment. Eh? I'm going to die. Eh? I am going to die. We are going to die very soon. Very, very soon we are going to die. How? I mean, what happened? How did it go? Bad. Very bad. Very bad. Oh. You mean that she can refuse to do it after your threats? He, he decided to talk to the, 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 the elders instead of doing what he said he should do. Asuka, talk to me now, eh? Asuka, talk to me now. Asuka! Asuka! Two hours now, father left to look for Isiako in the forest behind the house. I just hope they are okay. Or should we inform the villagers about this current situation? No, no, your, your father warned against such action unless he comes back without Isiako. He did? Yes. Gods of our land. Who could have made Isiako behave the way she did today? Could it be Azuka has come to some kind of harm? May the gods forbid. Not my own in-law. Hey. What happened? Abomination, Nkem. The worst form of abomination has happened in the like community. Nay, what happened? Did this Yaku harm herself? It's not about this Yaku. As a matter of fact, I didn't see her. Hey. Then talk to us. What happened? Shh. I found the chief priest of Uruwala murdered in good blood in the forest. <laughs> Father, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Mother, I'm so, so sorry. Please. Wait, 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 wait. Get up, get up, get up. Thank you, Father. Uh, Isiako, did you go to Badger Forest today? Yes. Uh, no, no. No, no, no. I didn't. When I left here, I went to Idigo community to apologize to Azoka over some bad behavior I put up when we had disagreement. I'm sorry I didn't take your permission before leaving, just that I... I understand. I understand you are very sad about the fact that you'll be leaving this house in 
a few days' time. Is the foul of Oruala. Ashike, go and release him. Immediately release him. Vindicated you for allowing you and the fowl that was hung around your neck to be alive from yesterday till this morning. That means you did not tell us lies when you said you had no hands in the death of the chief priest of Oruala. You may go now. Chiadaka. How? Are you. Do you want to let him go? But who, who killed my father? And how did they kill my father? We have done what the custom and tradition allow us to do in a situation like this. Awaka survived the night in this compound with the spirit of your dead father and that of our. Angry gods and ancestors. This shows that he is really innocent. He did not kill the chief priest of Orala. That means he did not kill your father, Ibudu, as we suspected. Exposing and punishing whoever that did that now lie in the hands of our gods. 
now be the next to take over from your father. The ball is now in your court. But without the Akadike of Oruruala, there is nothing I can do in that regard. That is why I said the ball is now in your court. Take up the foul. From this moment on, you are a total stranger in this compound. If you step into it without the Akadike of Urala, you shall die. If the fowl in your hand dies before the Akadike is found, you shall also die. But the gods forbid. You all know I'm the only son of my father. According to the customs and tradition, they will not bury my father in my absence. And he shall remain here until the Akadike is found. But that is unfair. In the open like this, what if it decomposes before? Nothing will happen to the corpse, even in a thousand years' time. Your father's corpse is in the custody of the gods, but his spirit will know no peace until he is properly buried. This is unfair, elders. Yeah? This is so unfair. Why don't we just consult the oracle? No oracle anywhere in the world will speak on this issue. Lest I forget, as soon as you leave this compound, you are forbidden, for whatever reason, to leave Umweli. Otherwise, you shall die. If you are still in this compound, by the time we bring down our hands, the gods will strike you dead. Gods of our land, I can't believe I sat back and I allowed the youths of Umweli dragged my own father out of this compound yesterday, accusing him of murdering the chief priest of Urala. Despite what I knew about the mother, I said nothing. What if he has come to some kind of harm? If Achike could kill his own father, what wouldn't he do to cover up his track? What if he has had my father mother too? to make it look like it was him who actually killed his father. How can I ever forgive myself if that happens? Can the reason for my wicked silence, even if I succeed in the end, ever justify my own father's death? He's innocent and I know it. Yet, I chose to... Father! Achike! 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 Father! 
Please, please. Father. Why did you do it? Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me, please. Please. But you killed me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, just... Show me where the academic is. Yes. I swear. I swear. I won't. to my home, your home. This is our matrimonial bedrooms. <laughs> Obim. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for everything. Thanks for making me proud of you. By doing what the king's men demanded. I'm so happy. You ought to be my dad. Today is your day. Our day. In fact, I am the, I am happy. I'm the happiest person. You happy. But you didn't dance very well during the bridal dance in my compound. Your father's compound. Now my compound is yours. I'm talking about dancing. I've never been a good dancer all my life. But later tonight, we will see who dances bedroom dance better. Oh, better still, let's start. Um, no, 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 stop. Stop it. You're making me scared. How? Well... I've never done it before. <laughs> it's okay, my love. I won't hurt you. You're my wife. Rather, I will make it a day to remember with smiles for you. <laughs> it's okay. That one is over. Let's go out and attend to the maidens that came back with us, okay? It's okay, my Oh! 
our land. Never reach. My love, I'm dying. My tears, my denials, and my pleas never touched any of them. Not even my husband. Oh, my parents! Look at me. Look at what they reduced such an innocent girl to. They tore me away from my husband and separated me forever from my own people. Please, please help me. Help you? How? I'm tired. I'm dying of thirst and hunger. <laughs> 